Happiness in marriage is not something that just happens. Good marriage must be created. In marriage, the little things are the big things. It's never been too old to hold hands. It's remembered to say, I love you, at least once a day. It is never going to sleep angry. It is at no time taking the other for granted. The courtship should not end with the honeymoon, it should continue through the years. It is having a mutual sense of values and common objectives. It is standing together, facing the world. It is forming a circle of love that gathers the whole family. It is doing things for each other, not in the attitude of duty or sacrifice, but in the spirit of joy. It is speaking words of appreciation and demonstrating gratitude in thoughtful ways. It is not looking for perfection in each other. It is cultivating flexibility, patience, understanding and a sense of humour. Having the capacity to forgive and forget it is giving each other an atmosphere in which each can grow. It is a common search for the good and the beautiful. It is establishing a relationship in which the independence is equal, dependence is mutual, and the obligation is reciprocal. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. Joel Patrick. Take you, Anna Francis. Take you, Anna Francis. To be my wife. To be my wife. I, Anna Francis. Take you, Joel Patrick. Take you, Joel Patrick. To be my husband. To be my husband. To have and to hold. For this day forward. For better for worse. For better for worse. In sickness and in health. To love and to perish. Death is too hard. I promise to love you with every bit of my heart and to follow you on all our future adventures together. I promise to be the most amazing dad to our kids, to always take your dinner requests and feedback, even if it's unsolicited. If the past 10 years together have taught me anything, it is this. 
There are many things in life that I desire. That might be a big house or a new car, a healthier bank balance or a full head of hair. <laughs> but there are very few things in life that I truly need. That's my friends, my family and my Anna. So, so tonight, without further ado, eat, drink, and be merry, and pay homage to my beautiful wife, to Anna. supporting me and never <laughs> failing to make me laugh. I'm proud of what we achieved so far and love the life that we're building together. As we start the next chapter in our lives, I'm so excited to see what it brings. But I know if the next 40, 50, 60 or even 70 years are as good as the last 10, it'll be a blast. Yeah. 